हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू यू शिवाजी ग्रुप ऑफ इंस्टीट्यूशंस ऑनलाइन क्लासेस स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी विल डिस्क्राइब चैप्टर मोशन इन क्लास 9 स्टूडेंट्स वी विल सॉल्व सम न्यूमेरिकल प्रॉब्लम्स इन दिस चैप्टर बेस्ड ऑन इक्वेशंस ऑफ मोशन स्टूडेंट्स आवर फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज अ बॉल इज जेंटली ड्रॉप फ्रॉम अ हाइट ऑफ 20 मीटर इफ इट्स वेलोसिटी इंक्रीजेस यूनिफॉर्मली एट द रेट ऑफ 10 मीटर पर सेकंड स्क्वायर With what velocity will it strike the ground? After what time will it strike the ground? Students, in this question, height of ball from the ground is given twenty meter. So students, distance s is equals to twenty meter. And if its velocity increases uniformly, students, as we know that rate of change of velocity is known as acceleration. So here acceleration is given a is equals to ten meter per second square. Students, here initial velocity of ball because we draw ball from a height. Okay, here initial velocity u is equal to zero. Students, we have to find here final velocity of the ball. When will it strike? To the ground, in final velocity v is equals to what? Students, after that we will find time taken is back to the ground. T is equal to what? Students, now we using here equation third, motion's equation third, third equation of motion. We know that. V square is equal to u square plus two a s. Here, students, we can write here v square minus u square is equal to two a s. Now, students, we put the values in this equation. Students, value of initial velocity u is equal to zero, and Acceleration is ten meter per second square, and distance is given twenty meter. After solving, we get four hundred. Now we have to find velocity v is equal to under root four hundred. Now v is equal to twenty meter per second. After that, students, we will find we will find the time when ball is strike the ground. For this, we use first equation of motion. Students, first equation of motion is equal to v is equal to u plus a t. Students, here we can write. V minus u is equal to a t. Now, students, we have to find time. So we can write here v minus u upon a. Now put the given values. V is equal to we have twenty meter per second, and u is equal to zero, and acceleration a is equal to ten ten meter per second square. Now, students. We have twenty upon ten. After solving this, we get two second. Students, this is the time when ball strike the ground. Students, our next question is: A motor boat is starting from rest on a lake accelerates in a straight line at a constant rate of. 3.0 meter per second square for 8.0 second. How far distance does the uh, boat travel during this time? Students, in this question, students, in this question, boat is starting from rest. It means initial velocity. U is equal to zero, and 
क्वेश्चन सेज दैट बोर्ड स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम रेस्ट ऑन अ लेक एक्सलेंस इन अ स्ट्रेट लाइन एट अ कॉन्स्टेंट रेट ऑफ थ्री पॉइंट जीरो मीटर पर सेकेंड स्क्वायर इट मीन्स एक्सलेशन इज गिवेन ए इज इक्वल टू थ्री मीटर पर सेकेंड स्क्वायर एंड टाइम इज गिवेन टी इज इक्वल टू एट सेकेंड स्टूडेंट्स क्वेश्चन इज दैट हाउ फार डज दट बोर्ड ट्रेवल ड्यूरिंग दिस टाइम Now students, we have to find distance. S is equal to what? Students, by using second equation of motion. Students, we know that second equation of motion S is equal to U T plus half A T square. Students, here U is equal to zero. Because both is starting from rest, so we put u is equal to zero and t is equal to eight second plus half a is equal to three meter per second square and time is eight second. Now students, we solve this. Get one upon two. Into three into square of a is sixty four. Students, two three is a six and two two is a four. Now we get s is equal to three into thirty two. Students, after multiplying this, we get three two is a six, three three is a nine meter. This is the distance. Which is travelled by the boat during the travelling in time eight second. Thank you, students.